Men, you're invited to Calvary Chapel Costa Mesa's Men's Conference. You know, there's nothing like being here live. You know, you sure you can do it over the computer, but this is where it's at, being here live with men crying and, and just getting to uh, know each other and, and being with the Lord, you know, being with all the pastors, because the Lord's here right now, and the Holy Spirit's here. So I'm excited, you know. Um, my encouragement, if I was to say anything about the Men's Conference, is to bring a friend. You know, I like that AT&T reach out and touch someone. So, uh, you know, I, I think it's it's a real blessing. Um, the testimonies I'm hearing from the people are great. Uh, we brought the men's home out here from the House of Luke Ministry, and uh, a lot of the men have been touched. So I'm enjoying it. I think it's a great thing. I hope we can continue to do it every year. To me, it's kind of like the Super Bowl, like the way Super Bowl Sunday, like the, the big e football, the biggest event of the year is like Super Bowl Sunday. Now as a Christian, I, I see that this Anaheim Men's Conference is like Super Bowl Sunday. You know, it's, it's just rad. It's just the teachings and, and seven, 10,000 men just love the Lord, the worship. It's just, it's rad. I love it. Entitled Stan, the man God uses. As God is looking down today, I'm sure that he's blessed to see a company of men. And from us, may he draw out those men who are willing to make the sacrifices and the dedication that we might be used of God to turn this world right side up. Featuring speakers like Brian Broderson. There's a life to be lived in the sense that God wants to uh, perfect us. He wants to transform us. He wants to make us personally more like Jesus. And not only that, but he has something for each and every one of us to do. Raul Reese, there's a lot of weak men today. A lot of little wimpy men. They not only don't like their wives, they hate their wives, they hate their children. They don't take responsibility for their actions. And the thing about it is not people in the world. It's the church. The church. And yet Jesus Christ is looking for a man after his own heart. Skip Heitzig. It's either a life of fulfillment and satisfaction that comes by a relationship with the living God, or it's not. And if it's not, all you have left is imagination. You make it up as you go. Better to live by God's revelation. That's the right choice. And Franklin Graham. When you tell a person that they're a sinner, when you tell a person that Jesus Christ is the Son of God who took our sins to the cross, that He shed His blood on the cross, that He died for our sins, He was buried for our sins, and that God raised Him to life. There's Holy Spirit-filled power in that message. It's Saturday, October 26, 8 a.m. at the Anaheim Convention Center. Parking is 12 bucks, so make sure to carpool. And don't forget, bring a toy for the Armor of Light Christmas Drive. For more information, call 714-979-4422.